The living room was still stuffy from last night's cigars. The windows were closed, and the street lamps coming in through the Venetian blinds showed the dust in the air. The furniture was kind of new and sleek, but it had a comfortable look, as if people really sat on it. On the bar in a fancy frame were Mr. and Ms. Dietrichson. They had a bowl of those little red goldfish on the Nelson bench, but to tell you the truth, Keys, I wasn't a whole lot interested in goldfish right then, nor in auto renewals, nor in Mrs. Dietrichson. I was thinking about that hombre coming out of the kitchen, the way he had looked at me, and I wanted to see him again, close, without that silly furniture between us. I wasn't long, was I? Not at all, Mr. Dietrichson. I hope I've got my face on straight. It's perfect for my money. Sit down, won't you, Mrs. Neff is the name, isn't it? With two Fs, I was in Philadelphia. You know the story. <laughs> what story? The Philadelphia story. What are we talking about? The insurance. My wife never tells me anything. It's on your two cars, the LaSalle and the Plymouth. We've been handling your insurance for three years, Mr. Dietrichson. Nice feet, Mr. Dietrichson. We'd hate to see the policies lapse. Of course, we'll give your wife 30 days. That's all we're allowed to give. She's been busy down at Long Beach in the oil fields. Could I catch her home some evening for a few minutes? I suppose so, but she's never home much before eight. That would be fine with me. You're not uh, connected to the automobile club, are you? No, the insurance company, Mr. Dietrichson. The automobile club is fine. I never knock another dame's merchandise, Mr. Dietrichson, but I can do just as well for you. I have a very attractive policy here. For instance, we have a new 50% retention feature in the Clinton covers. You're a pretty smart insurance woman, aren't you, Mrs. Neff? Had 11 years of it. Doing pretty well? It's a living. You handle just automobile insurance or all kinds? All kinds. Fire, earthquake, theft, personal liability, group insurance, industrial stuff, and so on. Right on down the line. Accident insurance? Accident insurance? Sure, Mr. Dietrichson. We should tell me what's written on your foot. Just my name. As for instance? Phil. Phil. I like that. But you're not sure. I'd have to drive it around the block a couple times. Mrs. Neff, why don't you drop by tomorrow evening around 8.30? She'll be in then. Who? Hey. My wife. You were anxious to speak with her. Sure. Only I'm getting over it a little, you know what I mean? There's a speed limit in this state, Mrs. Neff. 45 miles an hour. How fast was I going, officer? I'd say about 90. Suppose you get down off your motorcycle and give me a ticket. Suppose I let you off with a warning this time. Suppose it doesn't take. Suppose I have to knock you over the knuckles. Suppose I bust out crying and put my head on your shoulder. Suppose you try putting it on my wife's shoulder. That tears it. 8.30 tomorrow evening then, Mr. Dietrichson. That's what I suggested. Will you be here too? I guess so, I usually am. Same chair, same cologne, same feet. I wonder if I know what you mean. I wonder if you wonder.